Hello, my name is Steve Knopf, and welcome back to our books, and today we're doing a tag. We are redoing the If I Could book tag. I was tagged by the creators over at Bookworm Duo, and let's get started. If I could change any book cover, which cover will I change? For this, I chose Aldous Huxley's Brave New World. I just don't like this cover, and for those who remember, who've been following my channel for a while, or who've looked back to my older videos, I actually already mentioned this. In the Booktubeathon last year, I, in one of the videos, mentioned this book and I redesigned the cover. So, I actually have a different design for this book. I thought this design would look better and would be more related to the book than the one that was on it. Let me know what you think. I'm not the best artist, so I kept it really simple. Next question. If you could bring any character into this world, who would it be? I chose the main character of this book. So, the main character in this book is Ewelan, and I've mentioned this book before by one of my favourite authors, Pierre Bouthiot. And yeah, so Ewelan is a very intelligent character, um, she is brilliant at school and is very, very powerful in terms of magic as well, so if she could teach me a few tricks, that'd be really cool. If you could go into a book, which would you go into? So I chose one that you might not think of immediately as one you would pick. I chose the King Killer Chronicle world. I really like this world. Now, it's not a particularly nice world. There's currently a war in the book, so yeah, not the nicest of worlds, but I find the magic system in this book so interesting. The university, the fact that the university has a library that is so full of books. <sighs> I mean, amazing, right? Who wouldn't love that? So, that is why I picked that world. If you could have any animal from a book, which animal would it be? Now, for this, I had to pick the phoenix from Harry Potter. I just love the idea that it can, like, burn and then be reborn from its ashes. I just think it's so cool. And, I mean, an animal of fire. It's, it just looks cool, I think. But yeah, phoenix. If you could kill any character from any book, who would you choose? So for this, I went back to the King Killer Chronicle and I decided, you know there's this character in this book who's very annoying and he really isn't liked by the main character and he doesn't like the main character and his name is Ambrose and yeah, I don't have to say more. If you've read the first book or this book, you'll know what I'm talking about. If you could bring any character back to life, who would it be? Now, I don't want to spoil any books for you, so the thing is, for a character to be interesting enough for you to want to bring them back to life, you have to know something about them, so it's not a character who dies at the beginning of a story. So it would be giving away something in a plot of a book to say this character or that character. So, I'm not going to say anything, but I know a lot of you have read The Hunger Games. Now, there's a character in The Hunger Games who dies, a character that doesn't partake in the games. That's all I have to say. I think you might know who I'm talking about. I don't want to say the name just because it would spoil the last book. So, I won't say anything, but yeah, that character. <laughs> if I could have any author write me as a character, who would I choose? I would love to see two of my favourite authors work together on this because I I don't know, I just want to see what it turns out as. So, I'm going to pick Garth Nix and Patrick Rothfuss. I think it would be an interesting mix, and I'd love to see what they come up with. If you could be any magical creature, which would you be? I think I'm going to go back to Phoenix, because why not? If you could change the ending of any book, what book would you choose? Well, for this one I pick Dead Poets Society. If you've read the book, you'll know why. And what I would do is I would just change the father's attitude, so as not to bring on what happens at the very end. I will not say any more. Again, as it's the end of the book, I don't want to spoil it for any of you, but if you've read Dead Poets Society, you know what I'm talking about. If I could switch places with any character, who would I pick to switch places with? I haven't thought about this enough. I would probably want to switch places with someone who was in Narnia, because I just want to visit that world at some point, you know? It'd be cool. One more question, which is... If you could, who would you tag? And so let's move on to who I'm going to tag. I would like to tag Joe Reed's books, Fluffy Bookbug, Lindsay Ray, Teller of Tales, and Brie May. I hope you have loads of fun doing this. As always, I will be putting the link in the description to the original video, so you can go check that out. If you would like to check out the video that I mentioned at the very beginning about the cover and the original video I made with the cover in it, I'll be putting that in the description as well. I'll be putting the questions down there as well, so if you really want to do this tag, then go ahead and do it, and I hope you have great fun doing it, and I hope you have a great 
week. I hope you had a great week, and I hope to see you next Friday. If you would like to be kept up to date with my videos, go ahead and subscribe. That would mean a lot to me. I would love for you to do so, and see you next week. Bye.